What is up nerds? Will Wanderlands here and welcome back to the channel. Welcome back, welcome back. We're doing a thing in Ashraneer. Wave to the people, little buddy. Wave to the people. Oh man, it's been a day so far. Uh, yeah, this uh, stream is a lot later than I would normally do. Hold on, hold on now. Let me, let me just, let me just... Yep. Alright, that should be hopefully a little bit better. Um, yeah, streams a lot later than I would normally do. Normally we do pretty early in the morning, but today I had some stuff that I had to take care of early this morning. So we're doing the stream right now. Um, yeah, playing Ashenir, doing some things. Looks like we have some quests to turn in, which is awesome. I got, I got very little plans for what I would like to do today. So. We're just gonna we're just gonna figure it out as we go and see what's going on. I know last time we powered that monstrosity over there up, which is cool. Um, maybe maybe today we start working towards the center of the planet. I don't know. Yeah. Hmm. We definitely need. Uh, let's see. We definitely need to figure out power on Aatrox. We need to. Um, actually just kind of think about power in general uh so to that end let me, let me stick these guys on here there we go to that end i want to take a look at what we got in here um let's see let's see let's see i don't think let's look at medium the medium print all shredder that's the field shelter what is this? Soil canister. Okay, all right. We got some stuff going on in here. Uh, repeaters, all the automation goodies. What are we at? 10,000 bytes? So we're doing pretty good, actually, on uh, that. Maybe batteries might not be a bad idea, actually. Investing in some batteries? Hmm. I'm honestly, I'm not sure. I'm sorry to anybody whose eardrums are about to just get exploded, but I have to, like... Okay. Hopefully, hopefully that's. Hopefully, I didn't destroy anybody. I tried to be light. Uh, I had to adjust my mic. What else do we have in here? What else do we have going on? Like, do we have some stuff happening? Oh, also, also, I have some updates just while we're kind of checking stuff out in here. Um, so, two things are happening within this next week. Uh, and I'm not sure what I, I'm personally going to do about them. So, we'll see. But, um, the full release of Diablo 4 comes out in three days. That's a thing that's happening. Uh... I might, might switch over to doing that for a while. Um, and I say might because I'm not really sure how my network connection is gonna is gonna deal with that situation. It just depends on like how stable their servers are from the beginning and like how my network handles it. Um, so we might try to do that. If not, I'll probably just make videos about it, um, like short videos, and uh, we'll do it that way. But the release of Diablo 4 is this this week, I believe. It's in three days. Yep, it's the third. So on the sixth, Diablo 4 is coming out. I'm really excited about that. Super stoked. Can't wait. Can't wait to play Diablo 4. Also, um, secondary thing going on, I've also been invited to um, to a Minecraft server. It's like a PvP, like, nations type deal. Um, and we might try that out as well, just to see. See what's going on with that. See uh, see how we like it. Um, but it really all kind of depends on what what you guys want to do, right? Like, in the, in the end of it all. Of course, my, my input matters. But, um, yeah, so let me know if you guys are interested in either of those things. And uh, we'll check them out. I, th we, I think we definitely need this this Drill Mod 3. What does this require? Diamonds? Hmm. Okay. Well, let's think about that for a second. We need. We definitely need the third dr Drill Mod, right? Because um, we're going to get that 
if we can get drill mod three, we can get to the center of pretty much every planet. I'm pretty sure. Uh, and that's like a big one that we need to be doing. That's something that I really want to do. Um, I would, I would like to get to the center of the planet to p power up the center and also to, uh, to, to build a little roller coaster in the center of the planet. <laughs> Is that a weird thing to want? Like, I just want to build a roller coaster down there. Um, yeah, that's, that's also an option. What? So diamond is going to be, where is it? Is going to be graphene to graphene, which means we need hydrazine and graphite. Hydrazine is what? Hydrazine is two ammonium. Hmm. And hydrogen. Well there. I think we can accomplish that goal. It's not too bad. We got a plenty of hydrogen. We've got like three ca three canisters of hydrogen right here, and this one's full. I'm pretty sure. Well, it's almost full. Uh, so we just need. Let's see. Yeah, hydrazine and ammonium, or er, hydrazine is ammonium and hydrogen. So if we get some ammonium, we should be good to go. Now, if I remember correctly, you can't make ammonium in the soil centrifuge. It's not the greatest, like, because I believe it only gives you one or two. Let's look. Yeah, it gives you one for a full, I think it's like a canister and a half, which is not, not great. It's not great. Um, but maybe, maybe we can take a little trip around the place and see if we can find some ammonium just laying around. So here's what we'll do. Let's just uh, drop drop these bad boys off wherever. Um, we can actually even just attach these to the base somewhere. Let's just do that. Let's, that can go right there. That'll provide some power. Where else do we, do we have a free slot anywhere else that we can just stick these? Like, sure, this can go here. Why not? You get on there. There you go. That's the thing that's happening. Uh, where are you gonna go? You wanna just hang out somewhere and just do a thing? Hey, 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 right there. There you go. Look at that. Look at you go. You're providing all the power. That's good. All right. Let's take the boob card out. Wait. I should probably put some storage on here before I do this, huh? <laughs> probably for probably for the best. Uh, let's grab. I think we have a couple empty silos around here that we can grab. Like. Not that one. This one is definitely definitely not empty. Um, we should also probably clear the backpack out. Why do I have a oh I have a hydrazine thruster on me? Hmm. Let's just put this up here. Yeah. This carbon can get grabbed. There you go. Uh, I guess we'll just put this over here since we don't really need the power and the hydrazine thruster can go up here and the soil canister we don't have another one on us so we might as well keep that one on us in the backpack there that'll be fine I totally didn't even grab didn't even grab the thing that I meant to grab uh, I'm making questionable life choices at this point in time okay let's put that over there Let's grab. Let's grab this one as well. Come here, you. Yeah, we'll grab that, and uh, we'll just wander around. Maybe I grab. Hmm. Maybe I make a resource canister and slap it on here. Also, like that might not be a bad idea. If we could fill a resource canister with ammonium, that would be pretty good. I would I wouldn't complain about it. What is this? This is aluminum. How much do you have in here? You have one aluminum. How about how about you just spit that out? Oh no, this is aluminum alloy. No, this can just go up here. Yeah. And we'll take this with us. This'll go with us. This'll be the ammonium canister. 
We'll take this out. We'll fill it up. If we find anything else that we really want, then we can uh, take that as well. That sounds good. All right. Looks looks good. Looks good. I'm happy with that. Uh, how are we going to get out of here without crashing horribly? Mm-hmm. That was good. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, I've made way too many craters. I need to stop. I need to stop digging things out. I'm a problem causer. Wait, hold on. I'm going to grab that. Come here, you. Now, if I grab this, is it going to go in the canister? Like, if I put it up here. Oh, golden. Golden. All right. Get back in, get back in there. Let's go. Let's go. Come on. We got stuff to do. Is any of that in good condition? Or is this all scrap, like debris? Medium truck horn. Okay. Hmm. The rest of this is just debris. Okay. Well, well you know... You can't win them all, I guess. Uh, can we? Can we just? Yeah, hopefully that'll work. Ah, uh, maybe. <laughs> maybe. Oh yeah, off-roading in a tractor. Let's go. Hey, there's some graphite over here. This is actually a pretty good find. Uh, yeah, I will take that actually. I uh, will take that. Is there any more? No, that was it. Dang, graphite really is just a surface resource, isn't it? Why do you have to make my life so hard, graphite? I got one. One out of that. Hmm. Which way do I want to go? That's the real question here. What is this? Is this my backpack? That's not even great. I know, right? It's not. Wait, what? Hold on now. Can I scan this? What is this? Fireworks? Curious item. Okay. Power cells, I'll take it. Um... Do I need the tethers? Like, really? No, I, I don't think so. I don't. I don't actually need these tethers. Like, re when I really think about it. But uh, that's that's an interesting find. Yeah, it's. I don't find backpacks ever, which is cool. Don't touch my machines, Bell Luna One Research Base. Okay, well. Dude, what's up, Jed? Welcome, welcome. I'm glad you made it. I'm glad I made it. I had, I had some concerns earlier <laughs> that today was not going to be my day. Okay? Dude, I'm good. I'm good. <clears throat> Doing fantastic. Better now that I'm here, for sure. I mean, not like I was doing bad earlier. We went and did a... We went and did... Is that ammonium over there? Is that ammonium? That's ammonium. Let's go. Let's go. Uh, we went and did... Uh, my wife had a squish meet earlier, which was cool. That was cool. Um, we had some fun. It, was, it wasn't as big as it normally is, which was kind of sad. But it was cool. We... Uh, we got some donations for a local shelter and um, gave away some prizes to people that donated. So it was it was pretty sweet. It was awesome. So that was good. I've had a pretty good day. And now I'm here. We get to play Ash and dude. Super stoked. How have you been, though, Jed? That's the real question here, okay? Oh, 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 that's another cliff. Last time we did this, I got stuck. I got a sweet thumbnail out of it, but I also got stuck. And uh, I don't want to do that again. We're going to go this way. I'm going to go down here. This is also a cliff, isn't it? Dang it, it is. Okay, wait, we're going to go over here. We're going to go this way. Hopefully this one's better. Ow. Ow. It is the weekend. That's true. That's very true. <clears throat> Which is exciting. Oh, 
What was that at the bottom of the cliff number one? Something, something good, probably. You know what? Hold on. Let's um, let's do this. What is that over there? What is? Can I focus? That's just resin. A lot of a lot of resin over there. That actually looks like ammonium though. Can I like? I wish I could zoom in. Can we get a telescope? Oh, there's a bunch of clay over there too. Oh. Dude, screw cliff number one. We're going over here. I'm pretty sure there was graphite on the, on that other cliff, but um, we're gonna we're gonna go over here. Clay is a little harder for me to find. Oh gosh! Oh no! Okay, we're fine. Off roading. Off roading. Let's go. Ugh, I jumped it. Ow. Oh yeah, there's hell. There's hella clay over here. That's a lot of clay, actually. Uh, is this a cave? A sweet cave? It is. Look at that. Look at that. This place is pretty sweet. No, no, no! Don't fall down there. Oh gosh. I'm a mess today, dude. <laughs> nope. Stop pooping out clay. Just calm down. We can we can put this away before you freak out here. Hold on. Hold on now, buddy. There's also a lot of organics over here, which is good. I like that. I like that. Organics, clay, resin, all that stuff we use pretty frequently right now. Uh, yeah, I want all this clay. I'm gonna just like, yeah, oh yeah. This is a huge clay deposit. That makes me happy. Man, I should have brought, I should have brought all canisters. That's what I should have done. I'm a fool, Harry Potter. It makes me sad. But then again, I only would have been able to fit three canisters, so that would have been three unique items, and everything else would have been SOL, so, hmm. I guess it's a really a trade-off, isn't it? There's a lot of clay, dude. <laughs> there's, more, there's more clay than I can actually take in. I need to mark this. Cause uh, pretty sure Yeah, this is gonna take up most of this silo. Uh okay. That just happened. Did I actually just drop it down there? I did. I must have, right? Yep. Well, that's cool. No, no worries. Is that clay over there too? Oh wow, there's like, that clay goes, man, all right. That's wild. There's a lot of clay over here. Uh, but, dang, I wish I had some quartz on me because I would mark this. I need to start carrying around some quartz everywhere I go. If I had quartz, this wouldn't be a problem. I would be able to find this place again. No worries. Is this also a cave entrance? It is. This this area is dangerous. I could just drive off into a hole by accident. Somebody needs to fill these in. Look, there's another one right there. I'm not going to do it. It's not my job. My job is to take all the stuff. Okay, where are we going? So this this valley is actually really resource rich. Look, there's like four deposits of resin. There's that clay deposit over there. There's a bunch of iron, right? Mirror, yeah. Yeah, and there's like tons of organic here, which is cool. I like that. I'm with it. I'm I'm interested. You had me at clay. Dump, dump that down a little bit. There we go. 
Is this all trash or or what? That's a working RTG right there. Huh. Dang. And this is a small wind turbine. I will take that. That I can definitely take. What else you got in here? You got anything else? What is this? Just a breeze, okay. And there's a hematite deposit here, okay. That's cool. That's cool, man, that's cool. What else you got? Some more, de more debris. All the debras. Bunch of little debbies. Wait, what is this? Uh, four units. Man, okay, hmm. There's like literally, I can't do anything with this because I don't have the space on here for it, which is sad. That makes, it fills me with sadness. Um, well, I guess we're, using, we're leaving it here. That's fine. I'm sure I'll find it again at some point. What else we got around here? Is that another backpack, dude? There's backpacks everywhere right now. What is this? This is awesome. I haven't found one backpack this whole game, and all of a sudden there's like eight backpacks. Small squeaker horn. There's a curious item. Rebooting system. Reboot failed. Error. G -g -g -g. Elysium system log. I'm taking this. These usually have uh, quests attached to them. And there's a beacon in here. Oh, all the sweet bacon, dude. Let's go. Some batteries. I will take those. Yeah, give me that. A small canister. You know it. And some dynamite. What? Buddy. Come on. Dude. I'm literally finding everything except for ammonium right now, which is like, all right, yeah, I'll take, I'll take it. But like, ugh, the one thing that I really need though, I need that ammonium. <laughs> I need it. We need it. We need hydrazine if we're going to get diamonds and um, do something with the diamonds that I can't actually remember right now because my short term memory is garbage. What were we going to do? What's my name? That's long-term memory. Just kidding. Uh, hmm. Dude, if I don't find some ammonium soon, I might actually lose my mind, though. There's uh, some compound. That's cool. And some graphite. I will take that graphite for sure. No, I just want the graphite. We do need uh, graphite to make graphene, so that is also a thing. Let's put these on here. Give me this, thank you. Cool. Oh, the canister that we got is full too. Oh, this is a lot of graphite actually. It's good. That's good right there. It's like a mixture of graphite and compound. Okay, wait, hold on now. <laughs> hold on now. Just, just wait there for a second. Well, that silo is completely full. This in here. Actually, let me put these in here as well. These can definitely go in here. Yes, sir. Take that. That looks good. <clears throat> I like how the graphite kind of does look like pencil lead just all stacked up together it's pretty hilarious any more? huh? There 
is. There's pl there's plenty more down here. Uh, that nope, that's compound. I don't want that. All right, well, I'm accepting of this amount of graphite for right now. The drill mod, that's what it was. That's what it was, the drill mod. We need the graphite so we can make the graphene, so we can make the diamond with the hydrazine and the, and the things, medzine. And um, that'll make a drill mod. So we can go to the center of the planet and do all the cool stuff down there. There's more graphite. How come when I wanted to find graphite, there was no graphite? Now there's like all the graphite, but no ammonium, which is what I'm currently looking for. What is this world coming to, huh? What is that? Holy guacamole, what is this thing? That thing is wild looking. What is it? Frozen argon? What? Compatible with research chamber. Um, this is frozen gas? How do I? Dang, I want to get this. Dang. All this cool stuff that I'm finding, I can't take it home with me. That's, that's... It's really sad. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna I'm gonna have to just try to remember the direction that all this stuff was in and see if I can find it again. Where what is this? This is there's a hole right here. There's a sweet, sweet hole. What's down there? Hmm? What you got down there? What is that? There's a there's a thing right there. Oh, it's more frozen stuff. No, please don't slide. Oh, gosh. Yeah, it's more frozen uh, gases. That's cool. That is interesting. Can we, like, scooch, scooch down and not fall? I don't want to fall. I just want to scooch. Nope, nope. Stop. Calm down, man. Yeah, it's more frozen argon. Okay. That's crazy. I don't remember that being a thing before. Uh, what is this? We got thruster of some kind. Yeah, jump jet. No, it's just a pebble. Never mind. Debris. What is this? A research item. <gasps> wow. More goodies. A research sample. I'm going to just scan that. Is there anything else? I don't think so. It's just like a little drop pod. So we got some scrap out of that. We also got a research sample. Which gave us 493 bits. That's not bad. Not too bad at all. I'll take it. Oh gosh, please no. Please no. I just went out. There we go. I can't see anything. Oh. It's so bad. There we go. There we go. We're good now. What is this? Is this like a, a... This is a large wind turbine, isn't it? It totally is. 10 units of power. Hmm. That's pretty sweet. What is this? Junk item. Junk item. Too large for salvage process. Well, then what the hell is it even? What's your point? What do you even do, bro? What about this? There's a medium wind turbine on that. That's pretty cool. Oh, geez. Oh, no. I, I messed this up. Hold on. I fixed it. Uh, there's more junk over there. But these aren't the things we're looking for. <laughs> it's like literally everything but what I'm actually looking for. That's crazy. I could just suck it up and dig a bunch of dirt and uh, 
make some ammonium that is a cliff that i do not want to be a part of okay wait no please don't bend around this and get stuck yeah go just go back down go this way there you go good job buddy you got this huh I wonder. Well, that large wind turbine actually needs a large platform, but if I stick this on here, we'll just go chase after that in a minute. Actually, I'm kind of worried it's going to fall down into a hole somewhere and never come back, so it's just, yeah. Can you stay? Can you... Can you just get it together? Come on. Oh, come on. Lord. Sure. Sure, that works for me. Will this reach? No. Hmm. Can I pull this out? Wait, can I dig this up and grab it? No, I just made it worse. Okay. What can you attach to the top of the canisters? Um, that medium canister that I was just holding? Nothing. You just put resources in it. <clears throat> okay, this is not going as planned. It's, um... Can I get close enough is that close enough yeah like the top the top of this canister it just takes in resources at the top that's it it doesn't do much else other than that you want to open up for me yeah that was like instant oh man it's a research item are you kidding me i was hoping there was going to be like some cool in there i mean research items are cool and all Give me my cable back and my canister. I'm leaving now. I'm leaving because I'm disappointed. I'm not angry, I'm just disappointed. That. Uh, actually, now that I'm looking at it, that's probably hematite over there. Doubt that's ammonium. That's a, that's, that's an exocache right there. That little guy on the side of the mountain. Hmm. Almost tempted to just drop a silo and grab that exocache, because those things are difficult to come by. Hey, looky there! Ammonium! Sweet! We found it. That's awesome. How much is it going to have, though, is the question. Uh, more than I can hold, apparently. Okay. put this on here that we got three batteries that we don't actually need but I still want to hold on to so that's a thing let's move over here and oh yeah this is a fair sized ammonium deposit thank you thank you world that's exactly what I needed
Oh, it's massive too. Ah, oh, so good. I wonder if we'll be able to fill this canister with the ammonium that's here. I'm probably gonna drop if if this has more than what I can fit in the canister. I'm probably gonna drop the beacon right here, and that'll also lead us back to all the other stuff. So that's cool. Whenever we want to come back and grab that junk, we can. How close is this? It's about... Uh, it's almost half. Almost. This is good. Yes. I'm so happy that we found this. It's so good. Oh yeah, it's all over this area. It's so, so convenient. Oh man, there's a ton of hematite right here too. This ammonium is gonna carry us for a while. That's good. So this canister holds what? Yeah, 32 nuggets. 32 nuggies of ammonium? Mm-hmm. It's real nice. Let's uh can I build like a little can I can I that looks good actually. No, don't slide down into the hole. Wow. This deposit definitely goes down pretty deep. That's good. I also needed oxygen, didn't even realize it. Because I have attention problems. Put that there, put this here, that's good. It looks fantastic, I'm so... Uh, wait, we're so close. We just need, what, eight more? Not too bad. I think we can do it. This deposit's got it for sure. Uh oh. Right as I say that, hold on. Are you gonna run out now? Uh, there's compound up there too. It's actually good. This is all compound. There's ammonium right here somewhere. Yeah, I gotta be careful digging into there though. That's That could be real bad. There's a bunch on this side, though, we can grab from there. Yeah, let's put that in there. That's three more, so we just need five more of these. Dang, I don't know when the last time I ran across a deposit this large was. It's huge. It 
30. We just need two more. Hmm. No, please. Don't do this. Okay. Can you stop waving at people? Do your job. Do the job that I pay you for. I don't pay you. He works for free. Oh, come on. There's got to be one more left in here somewhere. There we go. Yeah. Just enough. It says that there's more around in there. Somewhere. It said there was more. Yeah, there's more under here somewhere. But that's all right. We got a full canister. I don't need any more right now. This will be enough uh, to make hydrazine and thrusters for a while, so... I'm happy with that. Stick this in here. Bam! That's full. Got the green light. Let's go. Let's go. All right. Let's do this. We need the compass. Where, oh, where is the base? It's this way. Look, more ammonium. Wow, what do you know? Um, this is also a cliff, and there's some more over here, too. Dang, you know what we're about to do, then? We're going to just, where is that... Where are you? Here it is. Boop. Uh, let's make it... Yellow. That way we know there's ammonium over here. And we're going to try to slide right into here. There we go. There we go. And we'll just slow roll our way on back to the base. So we can start working on the drill mod 3. I think ammonium and graphite were really the only things we were missing. We have hydrogen. We have all the other junk. If I pocket this right here, that should be flat enough, right? Oh, yeah. It's fine. Totally normal. Oh, yeah, okay. I think this is the uh, other side. No, this the base is still on the outer ring. Yeah, there it is. It's over there. Man, there's a lot of good stuff out this way. There's like tons of resources over here. This is good. I, I need to remember, we need to go from the base, it would be west. I believe we're going, we're going east right now. Uh, I'm not going to be able to get up that. We're going to have to make ourselves a little... We're going to have to get ourselves a little shim-sham right here. There we go. That should, that should be fine. I hope. Yep, golden. And I don't care what these plants have to say about it. I'm leaving. Alright, cool. Yeah, the base is right there. And we got our little yellow marker on the map. Tell us where we need to go. That's good. I'm feeling it. Feeling good about it. Hmm. How I'm going to get up there, though, is another story. Uh, hmm. 
suppose we could just go around like so and try to not get stuck here good good stuff all right let's take this ammonium let's actually turn this off we're going to take this canister and go put it on the large silo over there so we'll just loop that right there uh nope take all that back in thank you and these guys hmm I'm not really sure what I'm gonna do with these curious items yet so I'm just gonna put them in here this can go right there that's good tethers can come with me soil canister this fireworks What else you got on here? Nothing? All right, cool. So most, the majority of this stuff is gonna be smelted. So we will just, yeah, I don't know why you took graphite. There's literally nothing you can do with that. Can you control yourself for five minutes? Mm. Hmm. Okay, this is going to go over here. Same with these. This is like the random junk bin. Random things that we pick up throughout our travels. Thank you. Yeah, go ahead and... No, no, no. Don't put that in my backpack. Come on, there you go. I will take this before you try to cook it. And we'll just place it on here so it can get uh, stocked up with the rest of the graphite. Put that down. Uh, this one we have some dynamite in here which we can use for getting exo chips so that'll be good put those there the extenders what else you got on here we've got scrap which can get loaded up over here the graphite dynamite can go over there sure why not oh Oh, it didn't replace it. It just, uh, there you go. That ought to do it. And I think pretty much all of this is graphite with the exception of that one. This one organic, so we'll just put that. No! Dang it. Well. Aren't you just a genius? There we go. Okay, graphite, let's put all this away. Actually, let's put most of it away. We're gonna keep uh, four of them, I think in total. So we'll put these two back. How many slots do we have open? Four, exactly, perfect. Okay, so we are wanting to make hydrazine first. So let's pop that and let's grab access to the drill mod three. Which was fairly cheap. So we've got ourselves a hydrazine canister here. And with that hydrazine, we can make something graphene which is just one graphite, one hydrogen, or one hydrazine. Sweet. It's beautiful, man.
Yeah, give me that graphene. Gimme, give gimme. Give All right. Uh, let's actually, we need two graphene in total, so let's go back and make another hydrazine. Wait, <laughs> that's the wrong canister. I want this one. Tasty. Uh, whoa, 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 hold on. That's nitrogen. Uh, let's actually make these into another hydrazine. We'll make a few hydrazine. Who knows? We might end up uh, needing more. I say who knows, but I knows. We'll end up needing more. Cool. That's at least enough for our purposes right now. And then we can turn that sweet, sweet hydrazine into some graphene. Let's go. Get it in there. Make me all the goodies. Delicious. I will take that and we will take that and turn it into diamond. Both of those. It's a double composite. Beautiful. Give me the sweet, sweet diamonds. Oh, yeah. Oh, uh, yeah. Look at that reskin ammonium. All right, so I believe the drill mod is actually made on the backpack. Power cell, small solar, small battery, power extenders, boost mod, wide mod, inhibitor, alignment, drill mod, drill mod three. Sweet. Look at that. And just like that, we have our new drill mod. So we can get rid of this one and attach this one. Uh, not to the floor, to the gun. There you go. All right, cool. We should not have any more problems drilling ever, ever again. Never, ever. I'm curious. If I touch this, does it do a thing? What is that? What is happening? It just shot a beam into the air, and I fell into the resource hole. How am I going to get out of here? Somebody help me. Okay, I'm good. We're good. It's fine. Um, what did that do? Recovered entry. Can I use it again? Will it shoot another beam? Oh, the whole sky brightens for a minute. Whoa! What if I do it again? It formed like cracks in the sky. What is up with that? Or is that just the, the voxel grid? Nope. Yep. We just shattered something. What, what happened? Are, are we breaking reality right now? Is that what's happening? I'm confused. Um, I mean, it did say don't touch my stuff, right? Like... Yeah, don't touch my machines. So I'm pretty sure we just shattered reality a little bit. Let's try it again. Go again. <laughs> Break reality more. Oh, and then it just repaired it. 
What the what? What about the other one? What does this one do? Boop. System reboot. Okay, does this do the same thing? I mean, I'm not gonna lie, this is quite entertaining. Okay, so it's got the cracks formed in it. And now if we do it again, the cracks will, it's shattered now. Look at it, it's all the way across. It's in a band, like across the sky, look at that. That is wild. Pretty sure this was not a thing last time I played. <laughs> and I'm like, I'm just dumbfounded right now. <laughs> What does this mean? Is it going to repair itself or is it going to stay like that? I'm just going to leave it. I'm going to leave it like that. Is that a mission thing? Can we, like, if we go to the mission log, what do, what do you have to say about this, huh? What do you know about this? Tell me everything you know. Well, that's weird. Yep, that's for sure. It's definitely weird. <laughs> Some weird stuff going on in this universe. Hold on now. Find a way to power the strange structure. Oh, that's uh, that's not even the same thing. Activate a gateway chamber. Okay, a core concept. Dig deep, find the planet's core, and figure out how to turn it on. Retrieve the test data of exo prototype vehicle. Code name vert. Compass nav added. Retrieve data from busted exo prototype vehicle. Retrieve an exo chip. Blow up data recorder. Find vehicle data recorder on DeSolo. Unlock and print a probe scanner. We could probably do that. Uh, what does the probe scanner even do? Probe scanner needs steel. Use in an auxiliary slot to locate missing probes. I mean, it's a mission objective. So why not? Do we have steel lying around somewhere? I feel like I should. I have tungsten carbide. And it's also tungsten carbide. Wait, what is this? No, that's aluminum alloy. It's not steel. This is also tungsten carbide, isn't it? Yeah. Okay, what do I need to make steel then? I think maybe we'll just go on a quest kick, right? Argon, iron, and carbon. We have all of those things readily available. So here's iron. And, um, okay, okay. Yeah, that's enough now. That's enough. Carbon. That's ceramic. That's titanium. Carbon. Here we go. I think we only need one of each, and then we need argon, which I'm pretty sure we have some argon up here. No, that's not what I wanted. Uh, we don't have argon available in here? What is this? What is this one? Is that That's argon, right? Yeah, this is argon. Here, do the thing. There you go. Make steel. Do a thing, make steel. All right, cool. Let's grab that. Let's, um, uh, it's probably going to be on here, right? Yeah, probe scanner. Go ahead and make that bad boy. Let's see what's up with that. Completed. Echoes of the past. New mission. Chasing signals. Okay. So we've got a shattered sky. We've got our probe scanner going. So we're going to chase some weird signal around the planet. And we got solid fuel jets for that. Which I don't care about the fuel jets. But still cool. Uh, QTRTG bytes. I, I mean, I don't actually care. I want to. I do want to activate the planet's core. 
Activate the probe scanner to narrow in on the location of vintage probe. All right, let's do it. I mean, we made the thing. We might as well uh, activate it, right? How do I do this? Use an auxiliary slot to locate missing probes. What does that even mean? Do I like put it up here where these are? Is that not is that is that what they're talking about? Does anybody know? Oh, yep. Okay, that's it. Cool. So, um, you you do a thing now, or call the nearest car? Oh wait, there isn't one. Right. Hmm. Do I? What do I do now? Oh, I just press F on this. Okay. Cool. Scan. I. I'm not gonna lie, I love the music in this game. It's uh, it's so good. <laughs> it's really great. <laughs> what just happened? Did I break it? Did I break it? What happened? Did it find things? No? Does it have to have like three little dots on it or? Okay, missing. Draws three units of power. Mm -hmm. Must not be finding anything. All right, well, we'll go exploring and see if we can uh, get this thing to pick up on some stuff. These, how do these even work? Provides 50 boosts. I have so many of these, like, I, I think I have like six of these. How does this, how does this even, consumable device that provides an additional boost when jumping. Do I have to like attach it? Do I have to attach it to an auxiliary slot? Like, does it have to be up here? Um, here, little buddy, why don't you? Yeah, stay right there for a sec. Oh, okay. Oops. He's probably not happy with me right now. He's probably upset. Oh yeah, okay. That's cool. What? That's sweet. All right. Ow. Oh, it hurt. Okay. It was painful. <laughs> That's not good. Dang. Reach top speed in a gravity globe. Okay. Just roll with it. Oh, we get a cosmetic for that. That's actually really cool. That is one of the things I'm kind of doing is hunting for cosmetics. So we might want to do that. Calidor shells. Uh, didn't we already do this? No, we did DeSolo shells. Yeah, DeSolo recovery. Logistical chip. Provide exochip to logistics depot on Glacio. So wait. To this thing, right? Yeah. All right. Let's let's do that. Give uh, give me this. I'll put this right here. The tethers we will just Yep. Graphite will go up. Sure, yeah, wherever you want to connect, man. I'm cool with that. No skin off my nads. All right. Well, let's, um... I can check the mission log from here, right? Yeah, I can, okay. Let's see if we can't uh, find this probe, or whatever it is, and, um... Get ourselves some exo chips. The question is, do I want to take the buggy? We should actually we should actually probably make some dynamite before we do this. So let's 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 do that. Let's craft some dynamite. We're gonna grab this. Uh, I guess we'll take the tractor. Like realistically speaking, we'll need the tractor so we can actually haul exo chips back. I do want to go searching for them anyway. Let's see what else do we have. Uh, explosive powder. Here we go. Sulfur. Carbon, carbon. 
So let's just grab, hmm. let's grab ourselves a bunch of carbon. First, first things first though. Where is that silo that I had? I know I have an extra one just laying around. Yeah, here it is. Here it is. Give me this. We're going to put this back on here. We'll put all of our batteries on this really quick. So there's that. Let's uh, throw our batteries and our soil canister on here. That should be fair enough. So that goes there. This can go on there. Perfect. And we will grab ourselves a bunch of carbon. That's titanium. There we go, carbon. All the carbon, please. Yes, very good. That's, that's enough carbon. No more carbon. Put it all away now. Stop playing around. This is real serious business, okay? Can I just, uh, yeah. Let it go already. There we go. Uh, where did the explosive powder go? Here it is. You're supposed to recycle. Just continue making the things, but you're not. Why are you doing this? Why do you do these? Okay, we should be able to make at least a few... Uh, explosives. There we go, dynamite. I will take that. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, sir. I appreciate you. Yes, indubitably. Let us make explosives and go blow shit up. Yes, fancy. I'm a fancy man, don't you know? Uh, how much carbon do we have left? 13? All right. Here's what we're going to do. I'm going to take all this carbon and turn it into blowy uppy boys. And we'll just go from there. Sounds good? Sounds good. All right. You take that. You take this and this. I'll be back. Just wait. Just stay there. Don't go anywhere. Okay, I probably should have put the dynamite away first. If I'm, if I'm being honest with myself right now. <clears throat> but you know what? That's okay. Being organized is for chumps. Hmm. You know what? Yeah. All right. <laughs> yeah, I should, should have just done this from the start. There you go. <laughs> you take that. <laughs> Why didn't I think of this? Why was this not the first thought that I had? What is happening? Why does every intelligent thing I do have to be an accident? Hey Jed, are you still lurking about in here? Okay, why won't this thing actually cycle though? Oh. Right, because it is actually out of sulfur. Hmm. And I don't think I have a canister that just straight up has sulfur in it, do I? No, this is ammonium. Why do you have to be like this, world? I don't 
want to go to another planet to go get more sulfur. That sounds awful. Alright. Just make my day difficult. That's fine. Jerk. Alright. Let's take this with us. We're going to actually grab... Mm, mm, hmm. Hmm. Let's put this here. Let's put that there. We'll take this silo with us. Oh gosh, I am like clicking buttons that I should not be clicking right now. Okay, well, now, okay. Look, man, I'm gonna need you to calm down. Okay, you can just, yeah, you put that there. Give me this. We're gonna take this. Okay, nope. Stop. Just, just look. Look here, silo. I'm going to need you to cooperate, or we're going to have all the issues. I'm going to turn you into scrap. Oh, wait. Oh, no, I need a... <sighs> you know what we really need? We really need a large buggy. That's what we really need. That's That would make my life so much easier. Okay, fine. I'll take medium silos. You can just stay there, you uncooperative... Run for some biscuit. Sick your shit. You son of a biscuit eating bullfrog. <clears throat> I guess I'll take this silo as well since it's empty. We might as well. Gimme, give gimme, give gimme give that. Yep, yep, nope, that doesn't go there. Stop that. Control yourself. Control yourself, sir. Okay, put that there. All right, cool. Let's go and uh, see if we can't find some cool junk. Mm. Okay, yep, nope, this is fine. This is, this is fine. This is, yep, okay. Uh-huh. <laughs> nope. Just, yep, you got this. There you go. Okay, we're home free. Wait, I have to, I have to actually check the, the mission log though, because I totally forgot what we were doing. Remember earlier when I said like my short-term memory is trash? This is what I was talking about. Okay, let's see. Uh, I think it was logistical chip. Yeah, right, right. We're going, we're going for exo chips, exo chips, and uh, other goodies. And I'm pretty sure actually, if we go back this way. There was an exo cache over here. So we can grab that. Yep, yeah, maybe I should have. You know what? No, no, no. No regerts. I'm not going back. Not even one letter, okay? I think it was over here. Hmm. Where is the where is the the yellow marker? Nope, 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 dude. Look, if you're going to be like that about it, we're not going to go exploring. Okay? I will, I, dude, I will turn this tractor around. I won't, I won't turn it around, but I will be upset about it. It's this way. Uh, oh, no, okay, we're good. I just want to make sure I'm not going to drive off into a hole somewhere like that one, like that one right there. Uh huh. No. Okay. You know what? I'm going to have a heart attack playing this game. This is this supposed to be a calming game? It's supposed to be like relaxing. We have a good time. No. Uh, mm, what were those? What was that? That was cool. I want that. I want to go there. Please. Pretty please with a cherry on top. Hmm? Okay. Well, actually, let's stop really quick because let's get off. Get off the tractor. Yep. Uh, what if I scan right here? No. No. Okay. 
Hmm. Uh, we definitely came from here, so we're going to go there. What we're going to do is look for that exocache. Is that another? How did I miss this backpack when we came through here earlier? Was this even here before? I'm like almost positive this was not here. And I will take this curious item. Hate jobs like this when almost everyone's in a pod. There's nothing to monitor. Dr. Lady S. Elysium. Okay. Somebody's upset about their job. I mean, you know. I can't blame them. Who wants to work? Working is lame. If I could get away without working, I would. I would do it in a heartbeat. Two seconds flat. Why is it auto muting my alerts? Stop that. Okay, we're good. Sorry, I was checking. I was checking to make sure uh, everything is still connected. Sometimes, sometimes my OBS likes to like bug out and not show me things that are happening, and I have to check that. Otherwise, you know, I'm not talking to anybody when they're talking to me, and then it's just it's no good for anyone. Uh, okay, that looks like another cliffhang situation right there. We're going to go around this way. This also looks like one, but it'll be fine. Jumping it. Yeah. Wasn't much of a jump. It's more like a slow fall. But that's cool. Uh, is this just going to be more research items? I need, I need bigger mobile storage that is what we need like really bad but if we want to do that we need exochips so that's also a thing uh we are not close enough you know what we'll come back to this we will come back we have uh this area marked so we should be good that hold on now what is this what is that green marker right there We're going to it. That's what we're going to do. We're going over there. Go this way. Go on. The exo cache is like right over here. So we, we should be able to get that at any time. This green marker. I want to see what this is. Is it that thing? No, it couldn't be. Hmm. Is it like actually down there no 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 let's do this let's go over here and we'll go around and come back down so we'll go down here we'll we'll swoop around this way swoop swoop oh it's showing exocache on the map oh that's okay that's awesome actually it's really convenient is that what this thing does? It just finds exocaches? I mean, I guess that makes sense, right? It's, uh... Man, I kind of want to see if I can blow up two of these at once. But I... In order to do that, can I even store this on here, actually? No, I can't. So we might as well just blow it up. All right. 
Let's just do it. Uh, I was really hoping to, to be able to carry them around, but we can't right now, so that's fine. Bring out the dynamite, boys. Okay, just back up a little bit, though, because it's going to blow. Oh, gosh. Uh, uh huh. Is the tractor okay? The tractor's okay. All right. Uh, we got two for that. That's not bad. Not bad at all. All right. Pretty good haul. I'll take it. All right. Let's keep uh, let's keep on roaming. See if we can't find some more of the uh, good old exo chips. What is this? This is a part of a train station, right? This is a turnaround or whatever. Let me take a look at this. What is this? A site pylon. Marker deployed by Exodynamics to indicate a location of value serves as a rail line terminus to aid in transporting items. Okay, that's cool. I might have to go. Uh, there's like a bunch of these around the place. Also, like, what's what's up with these? Can be recycled into scrap. So I'm assuming we need the extra large uh, scrappy boy for that. And we will have to deal with that at some point. Hmm. And no. Unless there's explosives or some kind of awesome power generation on there, I don't want it. So that's just that's just the way life is gonna be for right now. I don't know what else to say about it. Let's go this way, maybe. Hmm. Wait, is this back where we came from? No, it's not. We're good. Hold on, let me get to the top of the hill. Okay, we're there, we're there. Wait.
All right, I'm back. Sorry, my uh, my wife needed something real quick. Uh, where are we going? Oh, 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 exocash, baby. No, okay, well, see, when you do things like this, world, I don't know how to feel about it. Now I have to go all the way around, and it's going to get off the map. Yep. Why, um, how are you going to be like that? You think I can make that? <laughs> I'm going to try it. Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> Yee! Okay. Yeah, I totally made that. It was fine. <laughs> Nobody panic. Nobody panic. Oh, ooh. Ooh. There's goodies over here. What you got? What else you got? Uh, graphite. Okay. And titanium alloy. I will take that. And that looks like steel or tungsten carbide. Steel. All right, I'll take it. I'm not complaining. Just less composite resources that I have to make. Let's go. Let's go, boys. I like this exploring gig. We're finding all the goodies. And I'm down. I'm down with it. I like it. Oh, what's over here? <gasps> hey, look, another battery. Hey, look, a medium, uh, medium wind turbine. Hmm. Can I put these, like, on on here? Because that wind turbine will fit on the front. Oh, yes. Yes, I can. Let's go. Get get those on there. That's good. Mm -hmm. This goes up here. That's, yeah. Yeah. And another battery. We can make, we, can, we almost have enough batteries to make a freaking battery array, which is awesome. Is there anything else? over here no this is all just the rest of this is just scrap <clears throat> and there's the exo cash right there that's good stuff that's the good stuff right there let's grab that yeah exo chips galore bro chachos Ow, my face. So, there's some more exochips. Which is very nice. I will take it. Not going to complain about free exochips. Uh, hmm. We're going to have to do a little thing here. Yeah. Yeah, that should be fine. That'll be fine. We'll be able to make that, no problem. Oh, yes. Oh, yes, we did. Hey, look, another one of those uh, Terminus things. That's cool. Mountains, all right. What's up over here, huh? What you doing? What you doing over there? Oh, does this have, wait, a site pylon? It looks like it's got a freaking drill. Attached to it. Okay, that's cool. That plant did not like me right there. It was, um, it was not happy with me. <clears throat> Not like I actually care how it feels, but, but, it still wasn't happy. Okay, what's over here? We got any goodies over here? There's another pylon. I have to wonder, like, man, we, we really need, like, I want to build a mobile base, kind of, actually, is, I think, a goal that I'm going to go for. 
Because that would be really cool. Imagine, like, having a base that we could just roll around anywhere we needed to go. I think that would be super duper cool. Awesome possum. If we're gonna do that though, we need we need exochips. Am I gonna be able to get down there? Probably not. Probably have to make like a little Come on now. Alright, that works. I think we should be able to get up there. Yeah. It's a little bumpy. It's alright though. Good. What is this? There's an exocache over there. Okay, wait. We gotta go up and around this. Yep. Let's, uh, let's, we need to go over that way and see what that. Because that doesn't look like one of my. Markers. That looks like something else. Also a battery. Look at that. Very good. And another battery. Okay. We can attach that over here. That's just two less batteries that we have to make in the future. And a uh, dynamite. Awesome. Anything else? Let's dig around. And see what they got going on over here. Get rid of that. Move this. No, there's nothing else. Okay. Alright. Moving on. Uh, we need to go to that little purple marker over there. Because there is an exocache over there. And I also kind of want to know what that little marker is. So we're going to have to go up and around to get to that. So, hmm. Uh, this is gonna be complicated here, isn't it? Come on, you can do it. You can do it. No, oh, no. Okay. How about, how about this? Huh? Yeah. <clears throat> what a beast. Uh, wait. This looks like it's in a different direction. Oh, there, there it is, right there. And there's a bunch of ammonia over here. That's pretty sweet. All right, we got explosives. Let's go. Let's put let's let's put the thing on the thing and do the thing. Okay, get in there. Just back up a little bit, buddy. There you go. Two more exo chips in the bag. Just two, right? Yeah, just two. Does it give two every single time? No, uh, actually, I'm pretty sure I've seen it just give one before. All right, uh, back out this way towards that little purple marker. I need to know what that is. I must know. Hmm. How is one to get over there, though? This glacier kind of does a weird thing. Where it rims the whole area. Hmm. It's a bunch of good resources over here. We might have to bring some of our canisters out with us one of these trips. And just grab all the resources we can and like all of the goodies that we can. I think we might we might make a few trips out just exploring and uh, checking stuff out. Is there anything good over here? I don't see anything that I'm particularly excited about, so I'll just go this way. There is an exocache over this way. 
And that is good. There's two more pylons over here. That's cool. Rock on. Where's this one? Oh, it's way up there. Hmm. Maybe if we go around here, we'll be able to, yeah, be able to get up there. Just got to go up this way. There it is. There it is. Gimme, give gimme. Give no, 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 don't fall. Don't fall. Okay. Uh, how about like right there? Nope. Okay, what about in, nestle you in this little pocket right here? Perfect. Are you ready for this, Exocache? Because I am. Just back up a little bit, okay? Yeah, yep. Yeah. Right, that's good. Yeah, two again. Alright, cool. We can add these to the silos here. Perfect. It's looking good. Do we have any more? I know we've got explosive powder, so we can make one more dynamite for sure. Uh, but beyond that, do we have any more? Uh, yes, we have one. We have one right here. And I will put that on the old backpack here. Perfect. All right. Let's keep on moving. Oh, that must be what it is. It's, uh, it's, yeah, okay. That makes, that makes sense. So whatever thing we were looking to scan is definitely getting farther away. Uh, because it's only, the scanner is only flashing one blinking light now. And before it was, it was doing one and then two. So... Good to know that this is up here, though. What's over here? Is there anything good over here? Or just more scrap stuff? Oh, gosh. Can I... Are we, uh, nope, we're doomed. We have to go down now. Alright, let's, uh, let's work our way back over this way. Can I get up here? It does not seem like it, at least not in the current state, so let's... Oh, I need, uh, I don't even have room for it, do I? Oh, I do. Let's grab that. Nope. We're just going to kind of... Yep. There we go. The tractor should be able to get up there now. Hopefully. Hopefully. There we go. Uh, let's try to go for this, this seam right here. Yeah. Perfect. Perfecto mundo. Where am I going? Uh, we are not going to make it up any of those, so we're going to go this way and see if we can squinch our way in here. Yep. I'm skinny. Okay, nope. Nope. Tractor? Thank you. Go around. There you go. Oh, there's, uh, there's some junk over here. Let's see. Let's see what they got. Uh, we got a medium wind turbine and some more dynamite. Hell yeah. Are you kidding me? Amazing. Take that. Take it right now. Less sulfur that I have to collect, which is awesome. Uh, I wish I could take this medium wind turbine with me, but I can't. 
because I don't have the space for it, unfortunately. Hmm. Well, it is what it is. It'll be all right. Oh, there's another exocache. Let's go. Oh, there's a lot of clay right here, too. That's cool. Oh, there's two of them over here. Oh, perfect. Oh, there's three of them. Oh, yes. Gimme, gimme. Wait, why why you disappear right now? Is it underground? Are they underneath? Yeah, they must be. Yep, they're underground. That's why they have the marker going underneath the plane right there. Ah, oh, that's unfortunate. I mean, we could dig down to them potentially. Like where, if I face, this should be like pretty much facing them right here. But I don't, I don't really have the oxygen to sustain that either. And I'm pretty sure Yeah, I'm like almost positive if I were to lay down tethers, it wouldn't work because I don't have an oxygenator on me. So we're just going to have to let those ones go for now. But we know that they're next to this this thing, so we can always come back to that in the future. This one is above ground, that one right there, so we can go get that one. There's also something here that looks like oxygen. Yeah, it's like an oxygen extender. Uh, I'm cool. They're kind of useful sometimes. Oh, there's actually two of them above ground over here. They've got to be up, up there. Yeah, they must be. Oh, nope. Nope, bro. Come on. Come on. Go on. Nope. Sir? 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 You can do this. I believe in you. Little tractor that could. Come on. Eh, no? Okay. Alright. We'll just go around. We'll just go around. It's fine. Uh, let's go through here. This should, this should work. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Totally, totally normal. Okay, I don't want to get too far away from those exocaches because I don't want them to disappear and then I lose them. I mean, we could always just travel around in circles for a minute and find them, but I prefer to not have to do that. I believe they're at the top of this mountain up here. They must be. Like right, yep, right there. Look at that. That's a cluster. All right, can I, if I dig both of these up, like, can I get both of them with one piece of dynamite? i put those right there. We've got one right here. So we'll just attach it like right, right there in between both of them. And let's see. Yeah, we're able to get both. Awesome. Oh man, that's so good. Did I just pick up scrap? Yeah, I did. Wait, I can pick up bundles of small debris? Why have I not been doing this? Oh, I absolutely can. Oh, what the what? Okay, so not only are we getting exochips out of these, we are getting debris that we can use to make goodies. Okay, that's good to know. Let's put this stuff away really quick. So let's put that on there. The batteries can go on here. So I can actually pick things up. This can go on here. This extra jump jet can go on there. Sweet. And we will grab all of these boys right here. Oh, that's nice. 
That is nice. Look at this stash of exochips we got going on. And we've still got what one is it we only have one or two more dynamite. We might we might have one on the uh on the tractor here that we can use as well. I have to look. It would be really nice if we have more. Yep. Yep, we got one more right there. Boom. So you got two more dynamite that we can use. So let's go this way over here. Uh, I don't think there's going to be anything that I want down there, so we'll go this way. I think this is going to be the best option because uh, heading back towards the base, I don't, I don't know if we'll find any uh, good stuff that we haven't already found. So. But actually, this kind of looks like a spot I've explored. That is underground, but just so. Hmm. Yeah, but it's still underground. I'm just going to try and flatten this out a bit. Okay, and then if we grab this right here, we should be able to, yep. Perfect. That's good. That's good. We can get, uh, well, we could if we can turn. Why can't I turn? What the hell is happening? Okay, dude. What? Have it your way. Wait, 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 wait. We got this. There we go. Get in there. Get. There we go. All right. Oh, oh, come on. There we go. Yep. You're doing great. You're doing great, sweetie. Okay. Oh no. Oh no, it's another. No? Okay. Hmm. Uh, I have a feeling that this exocache is going to be in here somewhere. Yeah, it's definitely in this mountainous area, the rock garden. <laughs> there it is. There it is. Come here, buddy. I need the goodies that you offer. There's no more in here, right? No, there's not. Oh, well. Sweet. Oh, that one gave three. Hell yeah. Awesome. That's fantastic. I was gonna say, I knew they didn't all give two or one. Not all exocaches are created equal, it would seem. Okay, where are we going now? We're gonna go this way. Can I? If I, can I sneak through here, like, right there? Yeah. Sweet. I feel like there's going to be one over here, because it made the sound. No, that's not a cache. 
Hmm. Darn. Mm, we've been here actually, so that's not good. This is just backtracking at this point. That's unfortunate. Yeah, we've definitely been here. What is that? Oh, it's just music from the thing. Okay. I thought I, I thought it was this thing making that sound. Dang! Ouch! Oh, ow! My knee! Oh. <laughs> ah, it hurts. <laughs> it's painful. Okay. Dang, I was really hoping it would find something. So I feel like we've been up there. But that might also be the easiest way to get around. So what we'll do is definitely crash into this plant. And then we'll go around the plant and go up the hill. That sounds good. That sounds like a fantastic time. I can definitely get behind this. More dynamite! Oh, yes! Ah, uh, today's just my lucky day. And I'm gonna take all these debris and make just little debris packs everywhere. So we have, like, oh, yeah. We're gonna have plenty of scrap. We'll have dynamite. It's gonna be all the good things in life. everything you could ever hope for Let's see hmm. oh jeez wait wait Where? Oh, that's interesting. Let's go check that out. Let's do it. Let's look. Doesn't hurt to take a look. Have a little look-see over there. Oh, gosh. That was terrifying. Can I uh, pick that up? No. Okay, it looks like Argon. Hold on, we gotta go get a charge really quick. We also should probably grab our little homie for the light. What is this? 
Titanium, okay. We've got a small wind turbine, uh, titanium alloy, more titanium, and argon. Yep. It's not bad. It's pretty good. So let's grab this junk. Hmm. I'm going to actually pull the tractor over here. Let's, let's move this this way here. And like right. Right there ought to do it. And then hopefully we'll be able to grab these. Yeah, we'll be able to grab all this stuff from inside here. Or from outside. Some titanium. It does not hurt to grab these kind of resources. Especially atmospheric resources. Because why not? It's just less power that I have to spend. Especially since each condenser uses 20 units of power. Um, yeah. Just finding it is, is actually pretty big uh, savings. So... All right, let's go this way. At least as far as power is concerned. Screw it. Jumping it. Mm-hmm. Okay, I'm going to park us up next to this guy here real quick. Uh... That is a scary hole that goes deep underground. There's also an exocache under there. That we won't be getting right now. Oh, come on. Are you serious? Okay, this should be close enough, right? Come on. It's got to be. Yep. Go ahead. Pop off. Hey, I said pop off. What the... Dude, this thing is a power hog. Like, what? Look at how much power this thing is sucking. Are you kidding me? Bruh. Why are you such a hungry, hungry hippo? For this? Well, I never... Man, I really wish I had a larger buggy. Okay, so I'm, I'm pretty positive that every single one of these is going to be... Or at least the large majority of them are going to be research items. So I'm not going to open these up until I have the space for them. Because there's just no point in doing so. This, is, this requires ammonium, if I'm not mistaken. That is something we could definitely accomplish at some point. Can I get up here? Does the tractor have the power to do this? Are you beast enough, tractor? Oh, yes. Come on. Okay, so it, it can get up to the top, but getting getting over the top is, uh, is another matter completely. Okay. O okay. Well, you know. Yep. There we go. Well, that worked out. Everything worked out in the end. Let's go this way. Just try to like, whoop, oh, right up that hill there. There we go. Good job. Good job, tractor. I'm proud of you. Okay, I'm less proud of you now. That's ammonium right there, isn't it? Yeah, it is. Hmm, I think I am going to go this way. But not for the ammonium. 
I want to go this way so I can get around here. Come on. There you go. You're doing great. Ooh. Looky, looky. There's some goodies over here. Okay, can I pick up any of these debris? No. No. Do I have to dig these out first? Wait, stop. Come back. Wait, come back. Gimme, give gimme, give gimme. Give oh, my backpack is full. All right, let's, let's drop off. Oh yeah, we have exo chips like filling up our slots here. Okay. And debris packs and greenery all right cool let's grab these here let's see give me that give me that can i pick this one up come on highlight it nope can't get that one might be because they're buried though so let's try and grab them now yep get that one get this one very good all right, more debris, more Debras. Sweet, sweet Debras. Ow, ow. Okay, look. I'm gonna need you to make up your mind. Can you or can you not get up this hill? Is that Exocache? Yeah, that one's above ground. We're gonna go over there in just a second, but I wanna see if there's any uh, any sweet Debras over here. Go away. You ding dang old boomaloom. Just a ding dang old. You can scan that, there we go. Give ourselves 158 bytes, it's not too bad. All right, uh, this is gonna be one of our last exocaches that we're gonna pick up if we don't find any more dynamite, which I I can't imagine we're gonna find more right now. But hey, I could be wrong. You never know. You never know. Alright, let's do it. I feel like if I just grab that the way it is, it's going to roll down the mountain. So we're just going to grab it and bring it up here. Somewhere where it won't go falling. Like right, right there is fine. Back up a little bit. Yep. Back it up there, killer. Grab that, grab that, grab this, grab that. Perfect. Okay, we've got one more bit of dynamite. So, what we can do, hmm. We'll just start heading back. Oh gosh, uh huh. No, that's not good. We don't want to. We don't want to do that. Let's let's just go this way. We're gonna go this way. We'll go around and then head back. This terrain is like something else, man. It is. This is this is Aatrox level out here. 
Uh, where? Is there anything over here that's worth checking out? No, I don't think so. We've already been over here. Yeah, we've really already been over here. Okay. There's like three pylons over here, though, which is cool. So we sh can just continue on this way. We should uh, find our way back. And uh, maybe we'll maybe we'll run into another exocache on the way. If not, we've got another dynamite that we can uh, use for whatever, really. Hmm. I wonder what's down there. Let's go look. Let's go look over there. I think... I want to say we've been over here already. But I'm also not sure, so... Ooh, ooh, ooh. Nope, it's not. We're fine. Looked like a looked like a sweet hole right there for a second. What you got over here? Yeah, we've we've definitely been here. I'm like almost positive we've been here. Can't pick that one up, okay. What about this one? Yep, some sweet debris. Sweet, sweet Deborah. No, not that one. How about now? Yep, got that one, okay. Uh this looks like it's oh no, it's not. It's just a it's debris, okay. I thought that was working for a second, and I was like, yes, but we couldn't take it anyway, but still, it's a good find. There's a working medium-sized one, which is cool. More debris. Nothing else of note though. There's also another rack over here that we can check out really quick. This kind of is in the general direction of where we need to go anyway, so it's not too bad. Uh, that is a hole. A large hole. Oh, oh wow. Really? I like never find dynamite and now all of a sudden like all the dynamite is mine or what? I spent all that time <laughs> getting the resources to make freaking dynamite and now now the game's just like yeah here have have a whole bunch of dynamite you want that you want this is that what you want? Hmm? <laughs> okay for sure I mean I want it I'm not gonna well I am gonna complain but that's that's not the point, okay? The point is, god damn it. Why didn't you give this to me earlier? Although, I wasn't actively searching for exocaches earlier, so I guess... Fair play, game. Fair play. Okay, I'll take all this debris for sure. Uh, what do you have in here? Titanium alloy, argon, and what? Aluminum? Yeah, aluminum. Aluminum. Minum, 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 minum. Alright, cool. That was sweet. That's a good little find right there. Awesome. Let's go to the top of this hill and uh, either fall off the other side or go down the other side. One of the two. Uh, it's going to be fall off. Definitely going to be fall off. Oh, nope. You good? <laughs> Are we? No? Okay. What is happening? Okay. All right. Let's flip that. <sighs> okay. How stuck am I actually? <laughs> Uh, nope, we're good. We're fine. Yep. Made it. <laughs> Lord, this tractor is a monster. 
Let's zoom out a little bit, shall we? All right, well, we'll just head on back to the base. I mean, we essentially got a return on the dynamite that we made plus exochips, which is which is good. We're on a winning streak right now. So next time we need exochips, we have uh, we have all the dynamite that we need to get started. Come on, dude. You got this. There we go. There we go. Good job. How is our little scanner doing? Uh, we're still at like two bars or whatever. I dare say we haven't found anything yet, which is a little bit unfortunate, honestly. I'm wondering if, like, uh, maybe we just can't find anything on this planet, or... I'm not really sure what that does. Let's see, let's grab this right here. Mm, that's a little ugly, isn't it? Let's try and yeah, flatten it out a, a bit, I guess. Sure, it's a, it's a little lumpy, but it'll be all right. It'll be all right. There we go. Yep. Come on, dude. Up and over. Oh, gosh. Come on. There we go. Alright, now jump off the edge. Whee! Yeah, we've explored a big old chunk of this planet. Probably gotten a large amount, a large majority of the surface exochips that are available, which is good. Glacio for the win again. I love this planet. It's fantastic. All right, let's try and go up right here. go over this way yeah perfect check it out here okay I'm going to cut into this a little bit so we can get up here easily there we go that should be all right that should be okay yeah, I want to get back and get uh, get researching and crafting. Because I would really like to, one, get to the center of the planet, and two, uh, get ourselves uh, uh, a kind of a mobile base running. Is this, did we already check this out? Yeah, we did, okay. This is right next to the base. Let's do it. All right. Home, here we come. Yep. 
There's another ammonium one. Oh, oh. Oh no, these are both underground. Okay. I'm gonna have to remember that for future reference. That's another thing we could really use is a mobile oxygenator. So things on the list, the mobile oxygenator or the mini oxygenator, whatever it's called. Um, the, the extra large, is it, it's not a buggy, it's a, I don't know, you know what I mean, the train, the land vehicle. And, okay, we've definitely been here. De yeah, definitely, definitely we've been here, uh-huh. <laughs> There we go. Home sweet home. Mm, probably best to go up this way. So let's let's exit stage right here. And well, I guess it was stage left, but whatever. And and nope, this is really bad. I'm doing a bad job. I am I am not. Yep, not doing well on that. Okay, that should be all right. Okay, maybe it wasn't all right. <laughs> maybe it was bad. Let's try going in this divot right here. There we go. There we go. Uh, well then, let's just plant these over here. There you go, buddy. Get yourself a snack. I just realized, actually, hold on. I just realized that the sound in this game is directional. That's awesome, actually. That's really cool. I did not realize that. So like if I plant on the left side of myself, it goes into my left headphone. If I plant on the right side, it goes into the right one. So that's, that's actually pretty neat. I like that a lot. It's like a, a cool detail. Gives some like realism to the whole thing, you know? What items do we have in the resource hole? Let's get these out of here, actually, so we can fill this in. And I can park the tractor over it. You can actually put this here? That buddy doesn't do anything, okay. I wonder what this recreational item does. I have no idea. All right, let's fill this in really quick so we can actually utilize this area again. We have little to no need for the resource hole at this point in the game. Perfect. And then we can just park the tractor over here. Sweet. 
park that right there. That's good. You know what I'd also kind of like to do is print another uh, large platform over here. Can I actually do that? Let's let's move the RTG up here really quick. What do we need for a, an extra large platform? B four iron, so we can do that. Let's do that. Um, I want to move this research station to an extra large platform and have. Where's the iron? I think it's this this one. Yeah, it's this one. Right. Hmm. Uh, shoot. Okay, let's put the titanium alloy over here. We can put this over here as well. The debris we'll have to figure out here in a minute. The argon needs to go elsewhere. The dynamite can stay on here. This guy can stay in here with us. Soil canister can stay in here, and argon, like I said, is going to go over there. So let's just grab this and move it over here. Perfect. And then we will grab our iron here. Have that pull all the iron back in for us. And we will print ourselves a large platform, or an extra large platform, B. Uh, yeah, we'll just let that go. I'm gonna put, what I'm gonna end up doing is putting a large silo onto the large platform B with the research chamber. So we can stack these up on the large silo and then we'll just have that much more uh, capacity for research. That sounds lovely. Okay. Uh, so resources, resources. So the organics, uh, the titanium. Let's see this aluminum. So all this stuff can come with us. Uh, the graphite. There's more titanium right there. This thing can, I guess, go over with these guys. Right here. Wait a second. Oh, this is the wrong one. Uh, it's okay. Wait, can I cancel it? Oh yeah, I totally can. Sweet. It's the large platform C, so we need two resin. Okay, we can do that. Let's grab, let's grab some resin real quick. Let's put, let's put these away. We gotta put these away first. So we'll take this. I'm gonna have to reorganize everything over here. Cause it's just a mess, but take all that, put it there. We can put this in here and it should get swallowed up by something. There we go. Those will get sorted into their individual canisters. <clears throat> And then resin, right? Resin right here. Perfect. We do need another one of those for compound as well. So let's get that started. That's good. Cool. Extra large platform. It is extra large and in charge. It is both. Okay, while we're doing that, we need to go over to this side. We only have 8,700, uh, 8, so I don't even know if we're gonna be able to research this just yet. So the auto extractor would be nice. Uh, extra large shredder would also be nice. That's two exo chips, 5,000 bytes, tungsten carbide and steel, not too bad. Solar array. Hmm. I don't know how much I care about having the solar array, but this is what I really wanted is a large rover. It's only 5,000, that's not bad. Landing pads, shuttles, 
Aluminum alloy, rubber, and two exochips, huh? Hmm. Let's check it out. Let's grab it. We're gonna grab it and see uh, see what comes of that. I also want to see if where is oh we already have the portable oxygenator. We just need the nanocarbon alloy for it. Uh, hmm. Can we? We don't have any nanocarbon alloy, right? Got aluminum alloy, tungsten carbide. Okay. If I remember correctly, nanocarbon alloy is like really, yeah, titanium alloy and steel. It's actually not too bad. Well, I'm pretty sure we have, uh, we actually just picked up some titanium alloy. All we need to do is make steel which we've got all the carbon over here. Car steel should just be carbon and iron. Yeah, with a little bit of argon. So if we open this up. And then we can you know, put all that back. We'll grab a little bit of iron here. Oh wait, what is this, carbon? Uh, ah. Why? Why? Okay, spit that out, please. There we go. And now I would like the iron. So let's make this steel. Shouldn't be too bad. Okay, so we've got we've got the steel here. Let's grab this, and we need the nanocarbon alloy, which requires helium, titanium alloy, and steel. So let's load up the steel that we just made. Nope. And then we will. Jeez. Oh, Go grab some of that titanium alloy that we picked up, which should be this right here. Perfect. And we will make ourselves some nanocarbon alloy. Awesome. That nanocarbon alloy we will use to make the portable oxygenator, and then we should have oxygen pretty much wherever we go. If, uh, if I am correct in my understanding of how that functions, I could be wrong, but you know. It says oxygen and portable, so I assume portable oxygenator. Make it. Do it. Oh, yes. Oh, yes, that's nice. Let's just put this right here. All right, so if I walk off away from here, so it is going down slowly. Let's turn this on. Okay, so it does require power. Right. How much power? One unit of power. Okay. So if we have a, a portable RTG with us, or a QT RTG, so to speak, let me grab one. We should have one around here somewhere just hanging out. Yeah, there's one. Can I put this on my backpack? I can. If I turn this on. So we are completely even for power. That is pretty dang sweet, if I do say so myself. 
How much does the uh, how much does this produce? One point five units of power. Hmm. I don't know, man. I think I like the QT RTG better just because it's portable. I could have two of them potentially. Wide mod, boost mod. What does the boost mod do again? Increases deformation speed attached to the terrain tool to activate. Okay, yeah, so we'll want to keep that around. The solid fuel jump jet I do want to keep around as well. Oh, man. I've got so much stuff on my backpack that I want to have on. So what we'll do, I suppose, is just keep one QT RTG on us. So we have the portable oxygenator if we ever need it. And uh, for the most part, we'll keep it off, though, I think is, is the way that we're going to run that. Okay, let's grab... This soil canister can go on here for a second. That way we have some space. Let's grab these and take them over to the scrapping area. I got some more of them right here, so we'll grab these ones. Should have the space for all three of those, yep. Now, do I have to put this in here? Yes, so we shred the scrap bits. Why is this not on? Oh, because it is full of debris. I think I'll just put this right here, actually. Ah, oh, darn it. Yeah, we'll just put that right there. That way, uh, it has a little bit of room to fill up. We'll grab these bad boys as well. Is there any more? Any more Debras? No more Debras. Okay. Sweet. All right, we've got our extra large platform here. The question is, where do I want to put it? I don't really want to have to carry this super far. What we could do, actually, is put it over here. Like... Like so. We'll have to make a new bridge going around or something like that, but that should work. And then we probably need to research power extenders. Yeah, which no doubt are going to be in the smaller medium printer, whatever it is. Uh, let's see. Power sensor. Battery sensors. Button repeater. Proximity repeater. No. Power switch. Splitter. Uh, actually, we have a bunch of these on here, now that I think about it. We have... Or we have a couple of them at least. Yeah, here's one right here. Right? Yeah, power extender. Hmm. 
Very nice. All right. <laughs> Let's just place that right there. See how far we can get with this cable. Okay. So right about there. actually go pretty far that's pretty cool all right i like these these are sweet all right let's put that right there perfect so we got power to that new platform we can put this back on here this is gonna move over here so we will just put it on the corner there let's flip it around so it's facing us perfect this can go on to here so we'll just place that right yeah, we'll place it right there. The RTG can just be moved over to here. In fact, I might just move some of this power stuff over here. Since this platform is no longer being used, might as well. This can just go right there for now. Uh, we can take this. and move it over there as well. And that'll give that spot space for its auto arm back. There. All right, let's check it out. Let's see, uh, let's dig these bad boys up. Perfect, we got a whole bunch of gumballs in here. Oh yeah, that's nice. All right, let's just plant these up here. Temporarily. Well, I say temporarily, but they're gonna they're gonna be there for a minute. Uh, maybe we'll put these ones. I guess right here doesn't couldn't hurt. right there perfect very good all right sweet digs man and then we'll just fill in this hole right here we gotta grab our uh, grab our dirt um, where is it here's one of them right hmm soil canister do we have another soil canister on here at all no we do not that's okay that is all right we'll just use this one. Oh, that's not what I wanted dang it Let's grab this guy down here. Come on, come on now. There we go. 
Filling in the hole. Very good. Okay. Let's probably take it from here and just flatten this out so it's all the same kind of height. Ah, dang. Yeah, it's okay. We'll just overtime it. So, like, we'll, once we pull all these out, we'll, we'll be fine. In fact, we should probably grab these pop corals as well. Yeah. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> There's so many of them. Uh, that one just went rolling off into the distance. What the hell? <laughs> that is insane. Oh, there's more of them over here. Oh gosh, we have so many gumballs. All the gumballs. Somebody help me. <laughs> I think this is actually going to fill... Oh no, it's not going to fill all of them. It's going to get pretty damn close. Okay, that's good. We got two more. I can't believe we only got a couple pink ones out of that. That's crazy. You would think we would get way more than that, but I guess not. So these, yeah, we'll just plant these over here, right? I want this pop coral, thank you. Dude, stop. Stop running. The more of these we plant, the more gumballs we get. The more research we have, the more stuff we can unlock. I'm definitely not going to plant all of those seeds because that's just way too much time spent. And we have a bunch of them growing already, so there's really no point in doing that. I will let most of these despawn. But I do want to have a good little, good little forest here. So we'll definitely get that going. Okay. My dog is upset. She wants dinner. cool that should be enough I'm happy with that I'm happy with that all right let's um is it gonna be in here I want to see if we can look into the extra large rover it's a large wait yes yeah, the large rover so aluminum alloy rubber exo chips uh, let's see what it's gonna take to get rubber and aluminum alloy so, if we go over here to our fancy schmancy chemistry lab, because we're like literal geniuses, just on the side though. Resin and organics. Why did it have to be organic? <laughs> okay. Um, hmm. Organic, huh? Dang. All right. Let's go and get some dirt really quick. We'll just dig it up from here. Why not? Okay, they're both full. Let's go ahead and go back. We're going to fill this up. Let's grab these. Perfect. I will take that back. And we will have this make us up some organics. So organic. And we are also going to need resin. So we'll make resin. Okay. All right. Just hold on a second. Okay. In just a second, I'm going to have to take a break to get my, get my dog out and give her some food and stuff. She only ate like a, 
a few hours ago, but. <laughs> she gets sad if she doesn't get all the attention. I know, it's okay. Just hold on a second, I promise. I promise we will go eat. And it'll be fantastic. It'll be the best dinner you ever had. I promise you get it'll get you I'll get you dinner. Don't worry. I know what you want. I do. Alright, let's get the rubber started really quick. Uh what was the other one? Rubber and Aluminum alloy. Do we have? I think we have aluminum alloy over here, don't we? Yes. Yes, we totally do. Right here. I will take that and this. And let's just use this other bit of organic and stuff to make more rubber. Hello? Okay. Okay, so we've got the aluminum alloy. We have the rubber. We need two exo chips. So let's do that. One and two. Perfect. Bam, bam. Wham, bam. Shablam, blam. Let's go. So we're going to get that printing. While that is printing, I am going to take a quick five minute break here and let my dog go to the bathroom and get some dinner and feed my cats and I will be right back All right, I'm back. Back and ready to go.
Okay, now I'm ready to go. <laughs> now I'm ready. And the buggy is printed. Wait, buggy? Rover. I don't know why I keep calling it a buggy. Uh, I guess let's take this over here. Put it out here. We're just going to see... Okay, that's a big boy. Look at you. Can I connect multiples of these together? Train length, one of four. So I can make more of these is what I'm hearing and carry them around with me. Hold on now. So this is like the mega tractor. Can I get, let me get two more of these exo chips. Uh, I'm gonna need to make, well, more aluminum alloy. We have the rubber. Okay, what do I need uh, to make? Aluminum alloy, aluminum and copper. Ooh, do I have copper? Ah, that's that might be a problem. We have aluminum for sure. So that's iron. What is this? Tungsten. It's been a hot minute since we used copper. Yeah, okay. So let's well, let's at least grab one of these aluminum here. And then uh, and I'm pretty sure copper is a unique resource as well, right? Like I can't just, yeah. I can't just make it whenever I want. <laughs> we might be able to ship some exo chips out for it, or not exo chips, some, uh, some scrap out for it though. So let's see, there's lithium, compound, resin, organic, clay, quartz, graphite. Sphalerite, laterite, it's malachite. Malachite is the one, right? I have to look to make sure though, because I don't want to order something and then it's wrong. That would be really, really crappy. Uh, resources, hematite is, okay, wait. I'm pretty sure laterite is aluminum. Copper is from malachite, yeah. So let's just order some malachite here. So one to one, really? Is it gonna bring back the amount of copper like per scrap that I sent? So it's a one to one ratio, but it's gonna give me one for each copper that I sent out. <clears throat> I guess we'll see what it ends up doing here. Yep. Cool. I'm actually super down with that. Uh, I need to put this canister away though. That can go over there. So let's grab one of these copper here. And we will make ourselves some aluminum alloy. Oh, right, I have to, I have to actually smelt it, duh. Probably gonna go like right here, maybe. It's just a guess. Nope. <laughs> Absolutely not where it went. Okay, give me that copper. Gimme, gimme. Aluminum alloy, please. Sweet. 
Sweet! Aluminum alloy. So we'll let that print. In the meantime, I want to check this out and see, like, is there, a, like, a large rover seat? Should be at the bottom here. So there's a rover seat, tractor, trailer, medium buggy horn, a winch. The paver would be really nice, actually. Let's... Oops. Fault finder. Here it is, paper. Attached to a rover to create roads wherever they are needed. Requires a soil canister. Let's grab this. It's 5,000. It's not too bad. Do we have a uh, button repeater? Yes, we have the medium resource canister, but we don't have the medium fluid and soil canister so we need 2500 bytes for that and I would like to grab that as well so we can carry that around with us on the ro the rover if we need holds a substantial amount of fluid or soil where what fluid what what fluids are we talking about uh oh also we have the rover seat unlocked so actually Pretty sure. Yeah, rover seat. Let's grab that. So this guy will just stick up here somewhere, I guess. Uh, is there. Am I allowed to spin this around? Okay, so that, that can sit like that. It's, it's weird because it doesn't really match up, but that's cool. That's alright. And we should be able to drive from there. All right, I'll take it. Sorry, tractor. Your services will no longer be required. So we can have four of these things? What is that, two? That's eight exochips? It's not too bad. It's not too bad at all. Let's um let's grab the rest of this copper and do a thing with that. So let's grab that, grab that. This one. Is there any more on here? There is, there's two more. But I don't have the space for them, so that's okay. That is alright. Let's plug this in here. So we'll get all this smelting down so we have uh, the resources we need to make the aluminum alloy. We are going to need to make more rubber. I kind of want to max this out. Um, we are going to need space to set this down though, so let me take this soil canister here. This will be our expeditionary vehicle. Oh, debris. Some sweet, sweet debris. Mm, out of soil already. Good. Good times. Let's just, I guess, grab from the roof right here. Actually, maybe we'll just chew into the walls some more. There we go. Alright, cool. Uh, we're going to grab from right here so it's nice and even.
pretty sure this thing's gonna be large and in charge, so so we'll uh, we'll want to make space for it. Let's see. This guy. Mm. Yeah. Let's like so. Un unpack this. Perfect. Almost flipped itself there. Okay. So them boys are good. Very nice. Just, okay, out of curiosity, let's go back over here. Auto extractor, extra large shredder. So we could probably end up carrying that around if we really wanted to. Okay, what about the large spot? Got all that, got all that, got all that. These are just platforms that I'm not too worried about. The buggy, the large rover seat. Portable seat that can accommodate up to three crew members. So we don't actually really need that. VTOL crane. The crane with a built-in seat and a medium arm slot. Huh, okay. Rail car, rail engine, recreational sphere. All right, interesting. So we're gonna we're gonna need organics actually organics and. Uh, I want to say resin. that breakdown and then we will grab one more of these resin that should be two yep two and two so we can make two more rubber we'll need to make two aluminum alloy so let's go back to rubber here rubber perfect let's go ahead and have this continue its thing and we will stick these on here somewhere. Yeah, that's fine. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. All the good stuff. This can go over here. This. This helium that can go there. This needs to go back where it came from. Uh, let me take that second rubber. Perfect. So all this copper here. Well, dang. We're just gonna move this onto the platform here, and then we will put this back where it goes. Like so. Awesome. Um, hmm. Let's put this up here. And we need aluminum. So, aluminum alloy. Why? Why? I have to manually insert this? I can't just take it from my backpack? What is this? What kind of world are we living in where I can't just do whatever I want? There we go.
Perfect. Okay, let me go ahead. I'm gonna actually stick these things on here for a second. So we have some room for stuff. Put that there. This can go right here. Cool. And we need two more exo chips. So there's one and two. Go ahead and print another. And then we just need that last aluminum alloy and we should have all four of the uh, cars that we can get. So we got that. Two more exo chips for this one. We just got a ton of exo chips so it doesn't really matter. Yes, perfect. Perfect. In the meantime, we are pretty dang close to having all the bites that we need to get the canister, but I want to make the paver. So let's take a look over here. I think it's in this one. I'm pretty sure it is anyway. Yep. Paver. So aluminum alloy and silicone. Silicone I'm pretty sure is compound and is it compound and, re and resin? No. I can't be right. Plastic, rubber, nanocarbon. Resin and quartz and methane. Ooh, I do not have methane on this planet right now. I don't think. Helium. I got a bunch of helium. Nitrogen, nitrogen, okay. Hmm. What we're gonna have to do then is take a trip to Aatrox and grab uh, some canisters of methane. Let's go, let's take this over here really quick and put it in the large shredder so that can go in there. Okay. So that's good, and then we can go... I'm pretty sure... Uh, is it actually in here already? These are, are these solid? Solid, there's a hydrazine. So let's go ahead and slap that on there this time. Hydrazine thruster, very good. Oh, it's so fancy, wow. Wow, very nice, I like it. Uh, okay, well that's going. We need, yep, get this last rover going, and that should be the final one that we can actually attach. So let's take this guy over here. Let's see. I can I can like barely move when I'm holding this thing. It's so massive. Slap that down right there. We'll not do that. We'll unpack this. Very good. Oh, yeah. Cable. Rover. Very good. Dude, this thing is huge. It's huge mungus. It's gonna, it's gonna be so good. I can't wait. <laughs> if I put a full RTG on this, it's gonna suck power from the rest of the base for a minute, but... If I actually remove this RTG, does this go any slower? Not really. Okay. Let me take this. I'm going to sit this like right, right there. So this should, yep, it's getting power. It's actually uh, getting more power than it's consuming right now, which is good.
So that thing's all powered up and ready to go. We're almost done with the last rover here. Let's see. We're gonna have to start moving stuff around for that to be a thing, but that is okay. Is there a better, like, stores items and provides four medium slots? Okay, what about this one? Eight medium slots, 12 medium slots. Convertible storage with slots that can be activated. What about... What is this? Solar array. Extra large platform A. Provides power, provides oxygen when connected to an oxygenator network. Okay, that, I don't know. I still don't know what this is. Stores items as needed, provides 31 small slots. 31 small slots, huh? How many does the silo provide? Twenty-four. So the medium storage silo is twenty-four small slots. It's actually not bad. How much does that thing cost? Eight medium slots, twelve medium slots. Wait, where is this thing? Where'd it go? Uh, is it in here? No, it's got to be this one then. Yeah, extra large storage. 31 small slots. Yeah, it's way bigger. We have this unlocked already, right? Yeah, we do. Iron and ceramic. Let's let's make one and see what it looks like. I want to get the most out of this rover. So, I'm going to I'm going to try and get as many available slots on this thing as possible. There's the last rover. That one will be charging up here. So let's see what we can do. I think it's going to be in here. Small shuttle, medium shuttle, large shuttle, rail station, shelter. Extra large storage. So iron, ceramic. So two iron, two ceramic. Well, I might just grab the iron. I'm pretty sure we had some. We've got one right here. Oh, and we need to make uh, the silicone, but we need methane for that, right? Right, right. So iron and ceramic. And we will take some of this iron as well. Okay, and let that go back in. Cool. Three of two, two of two, perfect. Let's see what this looks like and how it, how it fits into the equation, because I'm not sure if this is even gonna fit on on the rover. But it would be nice to have maybe one of these and a few of the um, 
the large storage silos. These guys. So we can... What is happening? Does the base not have power? Nope. We dropped power. Where is it drawing its power from then? Since there's no wind. Must be from this. Yeah. Yep. <laughs> Point 0.5 units of power. That d that doesn't make any sense though. Okay, the wind is back. Never mind. <laughs> Never mind. All right. Well, hmm. While that's doing its thing, let's just stack that right there. For future use. Let's uh let's go grab some methane, I guess. Uh let's see. Need fuel. Is this hydrazine thruster not oh it doesn't have any fuel, okay. Uh do I have some hydrazine here? I do. Do I have any more? No. Can I make more? Uh, there's the hydrogen. Let's. Let's see how much one of these fills it up. Then we'll go from there. Thirty four percent. We'll just make a little bit of hydrazine here. So I think this has three slots on it, or maybe even four. That's compound. So hydrazine there. It has three. So that's at a hundred percent. Wait. It's 34% for one. Three is 100%. Wouldn't that be 102% in total? So I just lost 2% is what you're telling me? 24 launches. Who cares? <laughs> Who cares? All right. Numbers be damned. What what is up with the universe right now? It is yeah oh yeah the universe is going nuts. It's broken. <laughs> no, we want to go to Aatrox. Let's go to Aatrox. Astronaut maths are similar to astronaut physics. <laughs> You're so right. None of it makes sense. <laughs> Also, welcome to the stream, Super Ribs. I hope you enjoy it, man. First time chatters. I always love to see it. Uh, let's hit this landing pad right here. That's hilarious. We don't we don't math in Astroneer. That's not a thing that happens. Uh, okay, wait. Right, we came here for methane. That's what we came here for. Uh, methane. Go ahead and just output. I'll take a, a few of these. Two. Can I fit one more? Yes, I can. Yes, I can. What is this? Sulfur? Uh, yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna take some of this as well, actually, while we're here. 
let's just jam these on here. Good. And what is this one? Nitrogen. I have some nitrogen back at the base, I suppose. I don't need it. Yeah, I'm okay with I'm, I'm okay with emptying the sulfur. I'll take it all. It's not like we really need it on Aatrox. Uh, right now we're grabbing some atmospheric resources to take back to Glacio. I needed methane so I can make silicone so we can make the paver. Um, but that's just kind of a side, a side gig. What we're really doing is building the, uh, building a maxed out extra large rover, the large rover. All right, launch. I'm going to see how close I can get to having a mobile base. Where, where are you, Glacio? Nope. I have literally nothing on it. <laughs> I ha I just just made the rover. All I have are the the four rover extensions, that's it. Uh I hope this is the right one. Wait, is this No, it's it's got to be this one. Yeah. What is the other one? I have another landing site. Hmm. Yeah, I, I have created like literally nothing for this thing. I'm just kind of like experimenting with things to see what I can and can't do. Okay, so I can fit one of these on here. That's cool. That's good times. Pop coral for days. Oh, yeah, dude. All the pop coral. Actually, we need to harvest again soon because we are running running low on the little bubble gums. It's the pop coral's only purpose in life is to feed me bites. Nom nom. All right, let's grab this methane really quick and build the paver. Mm, that's sulfur. That's for the explodey boys. This methane. You, sir, I would like silicone. Thank you. Wait, what? I already had methane? Hold on. I'm pretty sure I checked this whole place and I didn't have any methane in here. And now all of a sudden... What is this world coming to? Uh, it's it's quartz. It's quartz. That's why I wasn't taking it. Okay. Quartz. Oh, quartz. Hmm. That might be a problem. I do not have any quartz, I don't think. How much quartz can we get for this? Four? I'll take it. Why not? Uh, I think we have a soil canister somewhere around here. Shame you can't harvest pop coral, coral and dagger root. Only dig up. Yeah, it's true. It's true. It would be nice if there was like a more uh, automated way to accomplish that goal. Proximity repeater. Oh, okay. I haven't really messed around with any of the, like, uh, with the exception of the auto arm. I haven't really me messed around with any of the automation stuff yet.
it would be cool if like um, if like something like the crane could just dig them up for you that'd be pretty sweet but that's just wishful thinking Is you don't have to place the seeds each time. Oh, okay. I'm gonna have to check it out then. I haven't even played with the proximity repeater. The last time I played uh, Astroneer was before they did all the like all the automation stuff. It was a long time ago. It's always aluminum alloy. Always. Was it? Is it? Is it organic? I can never. I can't remember. Yeah. Yeah. It was a while ago. It was a long time ago. Thanks, man. Thanks. I am. I'm definitely enjoying it. I'm having a good old time. I don't think I have, oh, is this? No, that's steel. Yeah, I don't have any aluminum alloy. I'm gonna have to make some, I guess. So, copper and aluminum. Nope, take it back. Oh, it took in the copper, didn't it? Whatever, that's fine. I'm okay with that. There's some frustrations with Astroneer, but other than particularly niche problems, they're normally frustrations with myself, yeah. <laughs> Fair enough. Can't get too frustrated with Astroneer. I mean, I guess you could, but... Alright, paver? You were talking about the drill for the rover earlier, huh? Let's look at it. It's not going to be in here. It's going to be in this one. Nope, not there either. There it is. Drill head that attaches to rovers capable of drilling through harder terrain. Draws one unit of power while active. Drill strength three. Is this diamond and titanium alloy? 7,500 bytes. Hmm. Hmm. All right. I'm into it. This paper is pretty sweet. Can you actually, can you attach this to the, uh, yeah, you totally can. Sweet. Awesome. That's amazing. I like it. 
I like it a lot. Well, I guess that's what the tractor is being used for from now on. Just paving roads. Yeah, once you start getting like deeper towards the core. Can you can you you can't uh you can't get to co the core of any of the planets with drill strength 1, right? I have 3 just on my regular my little gun. I kind of want to check this out. Let's see. Uh, I'm not going to have power if I do that, though. Hmm. Let's do this. Let me take this off of here. We'll just stick it on there for now. Mm, it's going to require a canister. That's right. That's hydrazine. That's not a canister. Let's do this then. Give me that. Let's make 1.5 units of power. There should be more than enough power to run this little monstrosity here. You can on Silva, but it's slow going. Yeah, once you get like lower down, it just takes a long time to get through. It's cool. I have patience. I can wait for drill mod 3. It won't take that long. Well, that was short-lived because I forgot my power and my oxygen. There we go. We'll just grab from right here. No, no, no. Stop sliding, please. Stop that, sir. Just calm your little self down there, buddy. My little guy always wants to run off and just do some crazy stuff. Acting like a wild animal around here. Okay, can I attach this? No. Can I attach this? No. Attached to a rover. Does it have to be a rover or can I use it on here? I can't use it on here? Oh no, I totally... looks like I can. I do not remember how this thing works. It does work on the tractor. That's what I thought. I remember it working on the tractor. Rovers and cores are not the best mix. Oh, then we have to do it, right? Like, <laughs> if it's gonna cause a problem, I have to. I don't. Th I don't think you understand right now. <laughs> like, I need. I need it. I love how. I don't know if this happens to everybody, but my dude does a little backflip almost every time he gets off of this thing. It's it's pretty amazing. Look at that. Ah, uh, look at that sick backflip. What? <laughs> I love it. I don't know why it's so good. Now I can't get back on. Oh, there we go. I see what I'm dealing with. Yeah, yeah. I'm I'm that kind of person, dude. At least when it comes to Astroneer. There's other games where I'm like more serious, but. Astroneer, yeah, if, if it's a problem, I'm about it. Okay, wait, how does, how, how I do these? How I make road, how I make road good. Um, mm, mm. Head to the quarry rover, you'll love it. <laughs> All right, I'm down. I really want to make like a, I really want to widen out the core and just make like a little, uh, make a little roller coaster at the core. That sounds, that sounds like good times to me. But I also, now I have to know what happens to the rover if I take it to the core. Okay, sir. Um, wait, hold on. Is it? Oh, you know what? I might just not have the power for this, right? 
that sweet backflip. Let's try it this way. It should though, it has battery power. What am I doing wrong? What button am I not pressing? Okay, what am I doing wrong? <laughs> no. Attached to a rover, create roads whenever they are needed, requires a soil canister. Does the soil canister have to be attached to the vehicle for this to function? Does it not? It's got the blue ring, like it has soil. Uh, yeah, should be fine, right? What if I... Should be the same. Should just be the left mouse, right? Just like the just like the gun. Draws one unit of power, it should have enough power to be stable. It's got soil. What if... C or V? It makes a clinking sound when I do... Uh, CNV. Well, now it doesn't have soil though, so I'm okay. Actually, hold on. That's nope. That's wrong. Put this on here. Should have soil. Okay, we're good. All right. Off roading. Okay, that was good. It was great. Oh, there it goes. Oh yeah, this thing's sweet. Uh, I do not like the keys for this, but it's cool nonetheless. So if I... Oh, I just have to aim this and it makes it... Okay. Is there a way for me to, like, lock it to...
Interesting. What if I just aim down? Okay. Okay. <laughs> there we go. We're gone now. With an attached drill, so tractor is not the best. Yeah, okay, that makes sense. Interesting. You go over there for now. Ah, uh, backpack's full. You know what we need then? We need the, uh, the larger soil canister. And the drill mod, obviously. But I have to wait for that. Right? Mm, yeah, still have to wait. You know what? You know what? Let's do this. Let's do this. This is going to be better. Compound resin. Easy money. Let's see, how many slots do I have on this thing over here? Uh, two. I have two, I have two. This uh, this can go back onto this car here. I also need to print something else over here. Where is it? Rail station, shelter, extra large platform B. Um, Yes. Four iron. How much iron do we have left? That's the real question here. 11? Oh, we should be fine. The red line on the target means level with your current position. Moving camera up or down changes the angle. It's not intuitive and not fantastic to use, but very useful for roads. Yeah. I was hoping there would be some kind of like auto stabilizing. But, you know, whatever. It was never that way in the past anyway, which is, it's fine. I'll still use it to, like, pave areas out. I'll just have to be careful. I was hoping they had adds, added some kind of stabilization to it, though. Can you mod? Can you mod it? Is that what that slot on the front is for? Like, say I were to take. No, not that. Say I were to take. Where is it? It should be on here. There it is, it's right there. Like if I were to put this, the alignment mod on there. Can I, can I actually put a mod on there? Whoa, what is this? What's happening right here? Oh, that's, I see what it is. It's a resource slot. I see, I see. Option, uncluttered and uncomplicated UI, which means options and preferred functions are very rare. Yeah, that's true. That's, you know what though? That's one of the things that I really like about Astroneer is everything is very like s simple and straightforward. There's not a lot of fuss to it, which is really cool. It has its, it has its negatives, but it's also a really like interesting way of going about it.
actually, do I even want this over here? Yes. Yes, I do want this over here. I want it right there. Kind of. Maybe even a bit closer and turned a little bit there, like that. I can go there, and this will be power. Uh, where it should be printed, right? Yes, perfect. Research chambers. Go on. Go on. Uh, no, okay, well. Well, I see how it is. Me too in the main part, but there are some things which seem daft. I like the janky solutions people come up with and feel as unique as an individual place out. Yeah, that's true. That's true. <clears throat> there are some things that I would like to be like, I don't know, a little tiny bit more, uh, I guess, automated or intuitive, but in the overall, I like the whole billion dissolutions to one problem thing. Oh, come on now. Like this is one of them. <laughs> this is one of those things, like if I had the power to improve, I would. Although there are workarounds for this as well. Like, um, You can use gases as research or other items as research items. Can I have this now? No. No, I can't. It says you you do not you do not get this. None of this for you. And that makes me sad. Okay, if I don't plant some of these, I'm going to lose them all. But I also don't really want to plant them right there. So, that's a thing. That's true. I could do that, and then I wouldn't have to worry about them despawning. Or wait, you're talking about the have it collect the pop coral seeds, right? That are on the ground? Drill mods, boosts, etc. for the rover drills. Yeah, that would be awesome, dude. I would be... I would be stoked. If they added those things in. It'd be really nice to have something for the paver that just made strictly a flat surface based off of where you started. It wasn't affected by your mouse. That would be like the biggest thing that I hope for. I think it's almost unreasonably difficult to, to make just a straight up flat area. Even with the alignment mod and stuff, it can be like, cause it's so, it's so jerky. Just one of those things, though, I suppose. Did 
Dang, we really didn't get a big haul for this. And that makes me a little sad on the inside. But we did get a lot of pink ones, which is cool. Dude, seriously? How are you still connected? There it is. Hey, speaking of pink ones, there's another one. Go research. Uh, nope, 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 not flat. Yeah, I know. I know. Flat is one of those. It's like almost like a no-no word. You know what I mean? And I, I get it, like planet alignment, and it's based on a voxel grid that's almost rounded. So it it makes sense why it's so strenuous to make flat terrain, but. Yeah. Yeah, like this right here. I need to I need to move that around and then make it flat right there. But whatever. Ooh. Wait, no. Stop that. You put that down. There we go. That's better. Well, that's a pop coral forest if I ever saw one. And now I can't get through there. There we go. To a gateway. Really? You can get like a, a more flat. Interesting. From the gateways, huh? I guess that would make sense, actually. Okay, two more compound one resin I am I'm pretty sure I'm actually completely out of compound now dang life is hard uh, you can stay there do we have do we have dirt no dirt Why, why does the world hate me? Dang it. There are flaws away from 16 points of true flat. Yeah. <clears throat> And just the fact that you're working with like a, you're working with a rounded surface to begin with. For most areas. I mean, it's a voxel grid, so it can't be like perfectly round, but you know what I mean. Please tell me that is enough for any amount of compound it is. It is compound. Oh shit, I hold a, I had a whole canister over here of soil. That's just been sitting there. Probably should have used that as well. Oh well. <clears throat> I 
I'm going to have to try that sometime. I was messing around with the leveling block uh, like a week or two ago. And, uh, oh man, I made some, I made some weird, <laughs> some weird situations with that thing. Cause it does like, like you said, it makes a perfectly, like a perfect cube in the, in the area that you put it. So a perfect cube aligned to the grid. Yeah, that makes sense, cause like, I don't know the way the way I kind of think about it is like you're work you're working with a rounded surface, but it's a it's a voxel grid, so like it's never gonna be perfectly rounded. And then you're trying to make something flat that's already being rounded. It just makes no sense. But at the poles, of course, it's gonna be a little bit more flat, easier to work with. Uh, I don't know why I took that over there. That doesn't go over there. That goes over there. Come on now. <laughs> I love how I could just like throw things around. <laughs> it's great. L literally makes me happy. <laughs> okay, you go here. Right here. <clears throat> okay. No, let's turn it around, shall we? There we go. There, go faster. Oh, slower is what they're going. Hmm. Oh, because there's no wind power right now. That makes sense. It's not surprising. Okay, so, hmm. Here's my other thought with that whole array system that we're working on there. It, it wouldn't be in here, it'd probably be in here. Or do we even have it researched yet? Yeah, large storage. How much space does this, does this take up, does a large storage take up one medium slot or does it take up two? Do you know? All right, man. Hey, thanks for joining the stream and hanging out with me. I appreciate it. And on your lunch break too? Wow. A whole large slot, same as one of the base models. Damn. Ah, I was hoping to be tricky. Okay. Well, thank you, man. I appreciate uh, I appreciate that. Hopefully, uh, work goes by fast. If that's what you're doing, I know you said lunch slot, so speedy work time, speedy off time. Well, speedy work time, slow off time. This is the way. So it takes up one large slot, which is two of the medium slots. Hmm. No problem, my friend. Let's check this right here. Let's see. I'm never going to be able to put this on here. Well, no, I can put it on as the box, but I can't put it on here. Dang it, because it is a large slot. That's so unfortunate. That would have been cool. I can, however, put it over here if I wanted. But what would the point be? What would the point be? Well, darn. Ooh, drill strength.
Done. Diamond and titanium alloy. Let's go. Oh my gosh. But, but, I think for me as well, that is, uh, that is pretty much all I've got today. I did want to try and get to the core of the planet, but I went off on a few tangents and life got a little strange. We went and collected exochips and then we started making this rover and we'll have to continue that one next week because my time is way up, way up. I got to go make dinner and do all the things. Um, yeah, everybody that stopped by the stream, I appreciate you guys. It means a lot to me. Um, you guys are amazing. Super Ribs, thank you for dropping by the stream. I hope to see you again. I don't know if you'll uh, if you'll hear that or whatever, but hope to see you again sometime. Um, super awesome. I appreciate you for stopping by. Jed, as always, you are the bestest, and I appreciate you as well. Hopefully, I'll see you in the next one. And, uh, yeah, I'm going to get the heck out of here. I will see you guys next week. Uh, we might be coming back with something a little different, something, something a little strange. I know Diablo 4 is coming out, like I said, next week. Um, well, this week. So we might be playing that. And uh, we also might be doing doing something fun on a server. We'll see. We'll see. But I'm going to get the heck out of here. Hope you guys all enjoyed the stream, and I will catch you next week. All right. Later, nerds.